Madam Speaker, when President Trump first announced the Muslim ban, we were told it was temporary, 90 days according to the executive order, or until we figure out what the hell is going on, in the President's own words. It's been three and a half years. Hundreds of thousands of Americans, including many of my own constituents, are still cut off from their loved ones, missing births, missing weddings, missing funerals. We are still not admitting refugees to this country for the first time since we turned back Jews fleeing Hitler before World War II. And by now we know exactly what is going on. It has nothing to do with national security. It never did. There has never been a deadly terrorist attack carried out in America by someone from any of these countries. One of them is Iran, after all, a country that has itself whose people have been targeted for extinction by ISIS. How many times do we hear from the administration, we stand by the people of Iran even as we ban them from visiting our country? These good people were sacrificed for a cheap campaign promise. They were hurt, our country's ideals betrayed, because someone decided it would be easier to seek scapegoats than solutions to our country's problems. It is wrong. It should stop. I yield back.